Hey, if art is a crime, then just... Damn it! Think, Dawson, think. Ah, party at the Longhouse. Just gotta get there, mingle, establish an alibi. I'm a goddamn criminal mastermind. Seriously. What are you doing here? Why aren't you at the big to do at the longhouse? Um, uh, yeah, I just didn't feel all that accomplished tonight, but you look amazing. It looks great on you. Seriously. What were you doing up on the roof? Hmm? Nothing. Just... Were you up to mischief? Come on, I know you're in there. So just come on out. Or I'll call Betty and come here in five minutes with a key. You're up to mischief. Okay, well, come on, seriously, what are you going to do here? Oh, well, I have no choice. He's a cop. I have to be back here in five minutes, and if you are still here... Thanks, baby. This is the last, last time. time. I have to go back to my office. Apparently, I'm getting a phone call. I can't believe he doesn't have anything better to do. I gotta find a way out of here. Get to the longhouse, set up an alibi.
looking good. And the plan is working for my own brother over and over and over again. Maybe you should stop arresting your brother over and over and you over again. You think this is a joke? No, I is don't. Is this how you want to leave your mark on the world, huh? You think this would make our parents proud? Misdemeanor vandalism? Man, there's a lot of scary shit in the world. And while I'm out there actually trying to assert my talent, you're trying to assert your talent. I mean, what the hell are you always do this, about? right? You want to just let me know what big, bad, it's scary shit you're going to say Really? Because I don't seem to get what? Shrug. I'm going after those two. You stay back. That thing's gonna blow. Stay away from the exploding thing. Got it. Uh, Reggie, guy here needs some help. How's the military doing?
in there with the bioterrorists. Be careful. You know what those freaks are capable of. Yeah. Those freaks. Gotta do something. Betty needs me. Fence. Good to know. Not good. Wow, that should have hurt. Betty, where are you, Betty? Betty, where are you? Thank you. 
doesn't spoil the surprise. Almost there, Betty! Gotta get out of here, lady! Stay away from I'm me! I'm trying to help Don't you, lady! Stay away from me! Stop! Nelson! I was just trying to create a diversion! I didn't know anybody was in here! You did this to me! You're a conduit? Uh, Betty, I'll explain later, but you gotta get out of here now! Good, I'm gone! Not until you fix this first! I spent most of my life behind bars. It's easy enough to bust out. You just gotta wait for that golden opportunity. When I got my powers, hell, I was unstoppable. Until the DUP caught up with me. Yeah, they got a special hole they like to toss folks like me in. Figured out a way to bind us all up so we couldn't use our powers. That also meant they had to feed us, wash us, even wipe our goddamn asses. That's no way for a man to live. There's no way. They had this red-headed bitch there, really into needles and scalpels. She called what she didn't need tests. But if you do enough time, you learn a few tricks. Just gotta be patient. Sooner or later, they'll screw up. They always do. You make me see something or you hear something, learn things you weren't supposed to know. So when that bitch put the three of us in that wagon, I knew what was coming. A golden opportunity. I saw you. Poking around inside my head. It was me, I thought that was you. You saw it, right? That DUP prison. If she catches you, that's where you're going. Wait, wait, wait!
You ain't listening. Back the hell off. Good luck, kill. Hell no. No way I'm gonna die in a fish gunnery. Let me go. Just let me walk away. Nobody's ever got to know about any of this. Wait a minute. Stop and talk about me. Oh, Henry. I'm so very disappointed in you. Well, we got him, right? I, uh, flushed that mean old conduit for you. Good job, everybody. Especially you guys. Giant terrorist. Henry Daughtry. It's a bioterrorist. Conduit. It's a word used by traitors who sympathize with their cause. You're not a traitor. Are you? I, uh, try not to be. <laughs> you seem nervous. No. <laughs> it's been my experience. There are only two reasons for people to be nervous. Either they're cowards. They have something to hide. We can also get nervous around the girls. You were in there with that bioterrorist for some time. Did he share anything with you? Um, sure. Did he say anything to you? Share any of his ramblings about conspiracy? Um... No, he didn't, didn't share anything. Good. That's good to hear. You see, we are engaged in a life and death war with these bioterrorists, and it's my job to do whatever it takes to ensure that we win that war. Well, that's kind of funny because Aren't you a bioterrorist too? Okay, okay, okay. Yes, I am. Sometimes you have to fight fire with fire. And it's clear now that you are not a coward, which means there's something that you are not telling me. Well, what, are you, what are you doing? You can't do this, you crazy! I've got rights! I have the legal authority to suspend those rights whenever I feel it's necessary. Like now, for instance, I'll ask again, what happened in there? And I'll tell you again. I'm told that hurts. Maybe I know what happened in there. No, Betty, don't. Really? 